Hey Grace family, hope you're enjoying your Monday morning. I did want to bring to you today a scripture found in Matthew chapter 5 verses 8 through 9. We are back in the Sermon of the Mount discussing the Beatitudes this morning. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Today I want to talk about the integrity of our heart, the purity of our heart. Are we free from the power of our sin? Christ played his part. He, he died on a cross. He came back to, from the grave to deliver you from the power of your sin. But are we seeking after God? Are we chasing him, chasing after what's good and right in our life? Now that's a choice only you can make for yourself. I pray that that's the choice that we all decide to pursue during this time. Not only that, the pure in heart must have one thing going for it. We must hate what is evil and we must love what is good. Now, I'm not saying today that we must hate evil people and love only the people that agree with us. I am saying this. We must hate the act of sin. It must hurt our hearts the way it does for Christ. We must pursue Christ in what he thinks is good. We must chase after what Christ believes in instead of the evil that this world constantly offers up. Also, if we do that, blessed are the pure in heart, we will see God. If we pursue God, we will have a great relationship with him. You see, God is holy and he's looking for holiness in our life. Let us pursue holiness. Let us chase after what is good Hate the act of evil and chase after God with all that we have. In the next verse, we see, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Today, I encourage you to be a peacemaker, but at first, we need to establish that peace in our own life. We must ask God for the forgiveness of our sin, because if not, our soul is in spiritual unrest. So today, look at your heart. Is your heart a heart of peace, a heart of purity, or are we looking for peace? Are we looking for God to do something inside of our life? If so, ask God to help. God can and will remove your sins if you ask him to. He wants to. The peacemakers have been reconciled with God. We are made holy because we recognize our need for a Savior. Is your heart holy today? Because of this forgiveness we have been given, do me a favor. Pass that, on to, pass that on to other people. Other people will wrong you from time to time. I wish that wasn't the case, but I know that it is. So during those times, offer peace. Show grace. But don't stop there. You know that God has, has saved your life. Do me a favor. Pass that on to other people as well. Evangelize. Tell people about Christ and what he can do in their life. How he can take away their sin and make them right. This morning, think about these things. Think about the purity of your heart. Think about the peace that you have been given. And also help to be a peacemaker. Church, we love you. We look forward to connecting with you on Wednesday. We'll see you then.